from your father Luke. Twenty twelve is coming, and you're all going to die. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, children, to the Church of the Air, morning edition, and uh, to those of you who don't have a sense of humor, get one. Um, this morning's episode is uh, brought to you by Ahmed, the dead terrorist. I kill you! And, uh... shall be done at the emotional tone level to uh, appropriate to planet Earth. I was lying in bed, which is something I do best, wondering about, uh, I guess, uh, mythical Nibiru. I've been in science all my life, like since I was like six. Uh, I've uh, read books that thick when I was seven, eight, nine, ten, and uh, I would trust those books uh, I read 50 years ago more than what's coming out now because there was less of an agenda <laughs> than, than now, but not much less. However, um, I use the um, actuarial insurance company logic sometimes on things and <clears throat> If there is uh, something coming into the solar system, I used to have a telescope. Why can't we actually see it? Like you're seeing me. Um, they have crystal clear pictures of the moon, Mars, uh, Saturn, Uranus. And if they wanted to, they could point the Hubble telescope, which can see. <laughs> billions of light years out and billions of light years into the past and take a look and see what this thing is or there would be uh, amateurs with a 6 or 8 inch telescope who would be able to spot something like this and it is now October so we have November, December, end of the world and uh, Many people said there would be an acceleration of many things, uh, physical and mental, coming up to this uh, critical point. So uh, then I added in how convenient that, oh, uh, uh, we can't see it because, um, uh, 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 oh, yes, it's, it's a brown dwarf and it doesn't emit any light. Well, what are the actually insurance or actuarial chances that if there is uh, an object in the solar system that comes around every 3,600 years that it is also too dark to see and also has a huge gravity. So then I went to earthquakes <clears throat> and there's uh, there are people on the net putting up uh, charts of uh, earthquake activity around the world and telling us that it's coming, it's coming, it's going to happen. So I went to the U.S. Geological Survey <laughs> and typed in earthquake facts and statistics for the last 12 years. And look at what I got. A chart. Now, I don't have the computer chops to uh, put this into this video because I don't have uh, paid computer geniuses like the uh, New World Order and uh, CIA employees, I'm assuming, are doing the fear mongering work. So I'm going to just have to uh, read some stuff out of here. Basically, there has been no change since 2000. 
to now. And actually, in the last two years, there's been a decline in earthquake activity. So, for example, the worst earthquake is the 8 to 9 on the Richter scale. Uh, the average is one a year. Last year there was one, 2012 there was two. The 7 to 7.9s, last year there was 19. This year there were 10. The 6 to 6.9 earthquakes, last year there was 185. This year there was 91, the average is 140 a year, so that's down. 5 to 6 on the Richter scale. Last year there were 2,276. Ooh, scary. This year there were 1,213. Almost half. Uh, 4 to 4.9 on the Richter scale. Last year, 13,315. This year, 8,154. Down, let's say, uh, almost half, but not quite. Uh, 3 to 3.9 on the Richter scale last year, 27,091, this year, 1930. So down by roughly a third. Uh, 2 to 2.9 on the Richter scale last year, 3,643, this year, 2,465. Again, down by about a third. Uh, 1 to 1.9 on the Richter scale last year there were 47, uh, this year 34. Uh, there were 0 to uh, 0.9 on, on the Richter scale last year there was 1, this year there was 0. And uh, just as an interesting in 2000 there were uh, in the 2 to 2.9 range there were 4164 earthquakes this is worldwide uh, and, this, and this year there were 2485 uh, more or less half As more and more seismographs are installed in the world, more earthquakes can be and have been located. However, the number of large earthquakes, magnitude 6 and greater, has stayed relatively constant since 1900 till now. Uh, also, We detect, but generally do not locate, about 50 mine blasts, explosions, throughout the United States on any given business day. The mysterious booms and rushes. These blasts typically occur between 6 p.m. local time Monday through Saturday. Of these about one event every two days is large enough that we compute a location for the blast and post it to a separate explosions listing. Uh, now if I could post this you could follow along yourself but just generally um, the number of earthquakes remains more, more or less constant and then declines as we get closer to 2012. So, the Sheila Aliens model, it says, uh, traders beware. <laughs>